Hi there, James Chan here, Global Product Manager Lifecycle or Zebra Mid-Tier and Value Tier Mobile Printers. Essentially, that would be the ZQ300 and upcoming ZQ300 Plus printers, as well as the ZQ200 and upcoming ZQ220 Plus printers. Today, I'd like to take a couple of moments of your time to explain power savings mode that will help you maximize the usage of the batteries for the ZQ300 Plus printers. That would be the same for ZQ300 Plus printers. So here is a ZQ320 as well as a ZQ310. Both of them will have Plus models in the near future and all four of these models uses the same exact battery. So whatever I'm explaining here will apply to all four printers. There are two modes that you can set up in the ZQ300 and the 300 Plus series of printers. The first mode is the sleep mode. Sleep mode, contrary to its name, is the lighter of the two modes. The sleep mode setting is default on, and the default time setting is 20 minutes. That means in 20 minutes of no activity, the Zebra printer will go to sleep. When the Zebra printer goes to sleep, what happens? The power button will be blinking one of three colors. When the power button is blinking green, it's telling you that the battery is fully charged and it's still in sleep mode. It can also blink in amber. When the battery is blinking amber, that means it's charging the battery while it's in sleep mode. What you need to be concerned with is when you see it blinking red. Blinking red means the battery that's being charged is no longer in its tip-top optimal shape. What does that mean? Well, lithium-ion batteries decline over time. So when its health has declined, even if it's showing 100% or fully charged, you will not get the maximum 100% utilization of that battery. Therefore, when you see that blinking red while charging the battery, it's time to consider replacing that spare battery so that you can always get 100% of the life of the battery. Can you trigger the sleep mode manually? Well, yeah. To send the printer from active mode to sleep mode manually, just press and hold the power button for one to two seconds. Likewise, you can wake up a sleeping printer to active mode by pressing the power button for one to two seconds. Keep in mind, you don't want to press the power button for more than three seconds. If you do that by pressing the button three seconds or longer, that is basically turning off the printer. And turning off the printer is very different from putting it to sleep because waking it up is essentially restarting and powering the printer on just like the very first time you turn it on in the morning. That is the sleep mode. And the second mode I'm going to talk about is the inactivity timeout mode. That mode is a more involved power saving. The default setting of the inactivity timeout mode is on and the default time setting is 10 hours. So the sleep mode default time setting is 20 minutes and the default time setting for the inactivity timeout mode is 10 hours. Why is that? Sleep mode, you can easily wake up. Essentially, you should set that time for, you know, the time that it usually takes between two print jobs so that the printer can go to sleep and be awakened by the other, uh, by sending over a new print job. Inactivity timeout mode is for, when you accidentally left the printer on and nobody's there to turn it off, so after a few hours of no activities, it basically turns itself off. I have explained the two power savings mode that will help you maximize the utilization of your battery for the ZQ300 and the 300 plus printers. I hope this is helpful, but if you need more information, please visit our website at www.zebra.com. There you can find product information, product spec sheets, and you can also search our knowledge base over there where there's a wealth of information shared by the community of Zebra users as well as tips from our engineers. I hope this video has been helpful. Thank you very much for your continued interest and usage of Zebra printers. I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Thank you.